That's a good fish right there. There we go, girl. <laughs> This episode of Let's Take It Outside is brought to you by the Cayman Islands Angling Club and the Cayman Islands International Fishing Tournament. Every fishing tournament before this is just practice. Welcome back to part two of Let's Take It Outside, our Cayman Islands adventure. Hold on tight because in this episode, we're taking you on an offshore adventure chasing tuna and wahoo. Afterwards, it's time for a dip in the crystal clear waters at Stingray City. And you're in for a treat. We're releasing a wild turtle back into the ocean. Cayman Airways is the national airline of the Cayman Islands. They fly direct from Denver, Chicago, New York, Tampa, Miami, Havana, and beyond. Those who fly us love us, and I love Cayman Airways. Perched on the north coast of Grand Cayman, facing Cuba, and just minutes away from Stingray City, Rum Point, Grand Cayman, is a must-visit location. If you've ever wondered what the legend is of the world-famous mudslide, it was created in the 1970s right at the rec bar at the Rum Point Club. There's a lot of great ways to get over to Stingray City, but one of my favorites is setting sail on the spirit of Poseidon. Stingray City is a series of shallow sandbars found in the north sound of Grand Cayman. It is a tourist attraction where southern stingrays are found in abundance and visitors from all over the world can pet and interact with these wonderful animals. Legend has it, if you kiss a stingray, you'll have seven years good luck. And let's face it, I could use all the luck I can get. Pucker up. Let's go fishing. Hey, let's go fishing. Let's go fishing. Now, what is that? The yellow jack. Yellow jack. Some of the best sashimi you'll get. The Cayman Islands has some of the best yeah, bone fishing in the world. The best way to try to land one of these elusive fish is right from shore wade fishing. I'm still looking to land my first bone fish, but I did catch quite a few yellow jack that day. Yeah, you want some more. You come back for more. If you're looking for an up-close and personal wildlife encounter, the Cayman Turtle Center is a conservation facility and tourist attraction located in the West Bay District of the Cayman Islands. There's so many different ways you can interact with sea turtles here at the Cayman Turtle Center. I encourage everybody to have a hands-on experience here at the Cayman Turtle Center. You can interact through the turtle touch tanks, Smiley Saltwater Lagoon, and everybody's favorite, the turtle wading touch pool. Here you'll find yearling turtles swimming and playing where you can get into the wade pools for an even closer encounter with these yearlings. The Cayman Islands were first logged as sighted by Christopher Columbus May 10th, 1503 during his fourth and final voyage to the New World. He named the islands Las Tortugas after the large number of sea turtles he observed there. Since the center has begun local turtle releases, the sightings of green sea turtles by divers, residents, and guests have become a common daily occurrence. Did you know that the Cayman Islands offers world-class diving? You can dive a different site or wreck 365 days a year. It's no surprise the triplets of Grand Cayman, Little Cayman, and Cayman Brac are often cited as the birthplace of recreational diving in the Caribbean. I want to invite you to come and fish with us in the 2020 Cayman Islands International Fishing Tournament, April 30th to May 3rd. 
There's over $300,000 in cash and prizes up for grabs. We have prizes for lady anglers, junior anglers, and visiting anglers. Come fish with us and experience the Great Cayman Islands. For more details on the tournament, visit www.fishcayman.com. I want to thank Avis and Payless Rental Car for providing transportation for these episodes of Let's Take It Outside in the Cayman Islands. Stay tuned because things are about to heat up offshore at the 12 mile bank as we chase down some Yo, tuna and some out. wahoo. Woo, looks like a bear got my tuna. This episode of Let's Take It Outside is brought to you by Minn Kota Trolling Motors, built to outlast, outmuscle, and outperform the most trusted trolling motor on the water. Hummingbird Electronics with mega down and side imaging. Fish have nowhere to hide, simply, clearly better. T.A. Mahoney's, your marine supply store, Tampa. If we ain't got it, quit looking. Freedom Boat Club of Tampa Bay. Enjoy the freedom of boat ownership with none of the headaches. What lies beneath can no longer hide. New Mega Imaging Plus uses high-frequency sonar to show you fish and structure up to 200 feet below your boat and 200 feet out to either side. No more secrets. No more guesswork. Just a clearer picture of the world below down to a fish's species and direction. Because more detail means more of this. Whoa. Only from Humminbird. just left the Cayman Islands Yacht Club and I am on the boat with Captain Nick and I am so excited because we are headed offshore today to catch some bucket list fish. Where are we going? Today we're going to be heading out to a 12 mile bank. Okay. You know I've never caught a blue marlin, right? No. Today it, might it, be it, my day. Today might be a lucky day. Let's go give it a try and see what we can get here. That sounds good. Now, how deep is it out there at the 12 mile bank? Well, it's like a, basically like a mountain peak that's under the water. Mm -hmm. It runs up to about 90 feet. Okay. The shallowest point is about 90 feet. Great. Well, I'm glad I've been working out, Nick. Yeah. Yes. We're going to test it out today then. <laughs> Thank you. 
the 12 mile bank, 12 miles offshore in the Camelot Islands. We really just started getting lines wet about 30 minutes ago. Caught a barracuda, we got two tuna in the boat, and we'll see what happens. Here we go, check that out. We're going to use the small ones to catch the big ones. So right now we're catching these so we can use them for bait, believe it or not. We're not going to make sushi out of them. Try and see what happens. This is what we call a strip bait. So the black fin tuna, we use this for chunking. So the bite slowed down a little bit for about an hour or so. We're happy to get this bite. I'm trying to get these tuna in because we're going to use them for live bait, but I got to get them in before the barracuda get them. That's been the problem. Once we get these fish in the boat, we're going to drop them down for live baits and hopefully. Catch us some big wahoo. Don't forget the barracuda. <laughs> so now what's happening, we just got this fish in the boat. And what kind of rig are you putting on it, Cameron? Yeah, this is a little live bait rig. A little stinger hooks on top of it. You know, put it in the mouth just to keep it pulling straight so it doesn't pull crossways. You know, to get him back overboard before he dies. Look at that, Wahoo! Plantation on Crystal River is the place for Florida family adventures. Make memories while swimming with manatees. Scalloping is fun for all ages. Run a pontoon boat or paddleboard and spend time on the water. Parents can relax in the spa or play a few rounds of golf. The Plantation offers Southern hospitality with Florida charm. Reserve your family time on the river today. Children come from different backgrounds with different stories. They learn time-honored values like the importance of faith, hard work, and that an education is something no one can take away. They learn that respect begins with themselves and should be given to others. The Florida Sheriff's Youth Ranches, where kids learn, laugh, and dream with people who refuse to give up on them. With your donation today, we can give them a brighter tomorrow.
Okay, right now it's day number two out here fishing at the 12 mile bank here in the Camon Islands. As you can see, it's a little bit more rough, but the good thing about that is Wahoo like it rough. Steven's in the back, he's putting the lines out right now. We're using some ballyhoo with Islander skirts on them. Uh, on the line, we've got about 80 to 100 pound test, one on each. Uh, we're trolling about seven knots, and I'm pretty sure we're going to be hooked up real soon. bait size tuna and we're gonna pull them later to catch some wahoo but I also found out too they're pretty good eating because it's still tuna well we got a local shark on the line he looked like a decent size thought we'd catch him and bring him all up so you can see him might take a while. They don't really like to be brought up to the surface too much. Check that out. Okay, he's making a run. Oh, he's going back around the motors. Let's see, okay, I got him. He's trying to break me off around the motors. He might. Coming up to the surface. Check that out. I'm gonna bring him to you, Hudson. Okay. Oh, hold on. He's not ready yet. Okay. There we go. Nice release right there. Just having a little bit of fun with our local white tip shark. Woo! Okay, right now we're trying up another method which they call chunking. We're in about a thousand feet of water and what they do is obviously we're chunking, we're throwing some chum in and then we cut up some of the barracuda we caught earlier. That's on one of the lines and then we've got some other cut bait on the other line and we'll just see what happens. Well, I might have gotten robbed by uh, a little payback from that white tip we caught earlier or something bigger, probably. It's way too easy to reel up. Okay. Oh, man. What do you think? Yeah, it's looking like a tuna. Oh, shoot. Hudson, you want to grab it? Woo! Woo! Go ahead and play him, Cameron. Come on, Cameron! Get him! Double header, you guys! We've had a lot of fish on. Tax man took the tuna earlier. Wahoo are breaking us off left and right. We're trying to get this one in the boat. Oh yeah, look at that yellowfin tuna! Woo! Look at that wahoo! I'm bringing them around to you.
I'm Dennis Brownie with Florida Insurance Center, located right here in our home state of Florida. We take great pride in our work, just like you, which is why we are dedicated to providing quality insurance products with outstanding customer service. For over 42 years, we have been treating businesses as people, not policies. That's why we specialize each insurance plan to fit the needs of every business. From home, auto, and boats, we got you covered. Protecting your business is our business. We're here for you. And remember, Florida Insurance Center is the trusted choice. For 28 years, the National Pediatric Cancer Foundation has been funding clinical trials across the nation to end childhood cancer. Cancer is the number one cause of death by disease among children. Only 4% of the billions of dollars spent annually are directed towards treating childhood cancer. Visit fishingfundsthecure.org to learn how you can help save the lives of children battling cancer. You can make a difference. This episode of Let's Take It Outside is brought to you by The Plantation on Crystal River, Florida, where friends and families come to stay and play. Bass Pro Shops and Cabela's, everything you need to take it outside under one roof. Cayman Islands Angling Club and the Cayman Islands International Fishing Tournament, celebrating 23 years of catching. Every fishing tournament before this is just practice. April 30th through May 3rd. Go to fishcayman.com for more details. Oh yeah, look at that yellowfin tuna! Woo! I'm bringing them around to you. Yeah! Woo! Look at that, wahoo! Hell yeah! Oh, woo! Good job, Cameron! Yeah. Double header, bud! Right here, this is my first yellowfin tuna. Happy, man. We're going to try and catch a couple more and then uh, have some dinner. Okay, yeah. good job, Cameron. Yeah. Double we header. Two, we got two more. Woo! Yeah. Catching a buffet today. That's what I'm saying. I got a really nice yellowfin tuna. Biggest one I've ever caught. And Cameron just got a really nice wahoo. So it's paying off. Woo! All right. Yeah. That's right. <laughs> So we're right on the end of the 12 mile bank. We've done a couple of drifts in the new location where we got the tuna and the wahoo. Uh, we're gonna do one more, right? And yeah, use up our chum. One, one more drift and then uh, use up the rest of the chum there. See if we can get some more blood in the deck. That's right, woo! Oh yeah, he's all wrapped up, okay, yeah. <laughs> As you can see, fishing in the Cayman Islands is amazing. Caught my first yellowfin tuna. I'm so excited, and I owe it all to you guys, Stephen and Cameron. Congrats. It was a pleasure. Happy birthday. Yeah. I'll tell you what, if you want to catch fish in the Cayman Islands, you need to fish with these guys. This is Misty, nice wahoo we caught today on the 12 mile bank. Uh, just gonna fillet it off, be nice dinner tonight. Some people say I took the wrong job. Should have been a doctor. <laughs> All this part here is full of bones. Sometimes it has a little worms in it, so you don't want to eat this part right here. So what I'm gonna do now is I'm gonna take it out of the skin. Do it this way, we take out the bloodline. That's the next little bitter part of the fish. It doesn't get any fresher than this. From the ocean to the pot. I want to thank Captain Cameron and Captain Nick. We had a great day. Caught some tuna, caught some barracuda, and now we're closing it out with a dip in the pool with these amazing stingrays. Say hi, 
Today, we're participating in something extremely special, the release of over 20 turtles into the wild. If you want to be part of this historic tradition in the Cayman Islands, come visit in November during Pirates Fest. The Turtle Center here in the Cayman Islands has released over 31,000 turtles into the wild. It's just part of the rich tradition here in the Cayman Islands. enjoyed our Cayman Island adventures. Be sure to join us next week for Visit Tampa Bay. We're doing everything from bow fishing, hiking, paddling with gators, and landing a monster snook or two. Welcome, guys. Oh, no. Cut, cut that out. Cut that out. <laughs> you guys saw those. Hudson! <laughs> Yeah, there you go. Say hi, everybody. Hi, America. Yeah. <laughs> so we brought along our chummer this trip, so and it's working really good. Okay, I'm gonna start again. 